Books smell our Sunday, yeah, yeah. I sing it every time we have the show. What up, y'all? Um, so it's been a long freaking time since I filmed one of these, and I decided that I need a fucking vlog. Such a weird term, vlog. But recently, this book inspired me to get back into this shit. It's uh, some of you have probably started watching the show, but I don't have TV, and my friend Jeremy has been telling me forever, fucking read it. So, this week, we are gonna smell the strain. Get a copy out of the fucking library. It smells good. Look at how fucking vanilla that shit is. But anyway, so, in case you don't know what this is about, it's yeah, it's about vampires. Instead of it being all like dreamy like, Oh, he's so handsome. Sweep me off my feet. Turn me into a goddamn vampire. It's more like, holy shit, this is terrifying. Like, kind of H.P. Lovecraft-esque, mysterious creature from the dark. How the hell this even happen biological horror like stuff of your nightmares and that's the kind of vampires I want to see screw being beautiful beautiful is overrated says the girl who's so cute <laughs> um so I think you should give it a shot I've only read the first of the trilogy so yet it's to be determined but I think it's very promising it I would say, like, the first part of it, I was actually kind of bored, which happens to me with Lovecraft. He's just trying to, like, set up the story. And so, just bear with it. And, like, about a quarter way through or half or whatever, I was just, like, I couldn't put it down. It's, like, one moment I'm telling somebody, oh, this is terrible. Next minute, it's, like, where'd she go? I haven't seen her in a few days. I wasn't dead. I was reading. So, on to my favorite part, the smell. It smells like something familiar. You know, when you're younger, you ever get, like, those little scented erasers from Sanrio? They're, like, in these little plastic boxes that were clear. Like, a friend gave me one, and it was a chocolate-scented eraser. That's exactly what this smells like. Second smell time. So it also kind of smells like wheat flour and something sweet or more like cinnamony. Anyways, next time on Book Smeller Sunday, we'll smell the shit out of any fucking book. Bye. After I filmed that, I realized how glitchy my computer got while I was recording, so I wholeheartedly apologize, but I am not going to refilm that shit. All my reviews are improvised, and that's how I prefer to keep it. It's priceless. <laughs>